what's up guys uh, last time we did uh, quite a few time duels um, and uh, I think we only have two left for the uh, for, let's see yeah for uh, us to get up to 80 time duels so uh, with that being said let's go here to level four so yeah let's just go ahead and complete level four here and then uh, we're gonna go through the week like normal so number 79 Although, I don't know, maybe these will stump us, and uh, <laughs> these will be the only uh, things we do in the episode. Let's see, Call of the Haunted, Shinado, wow. Guardian Angel Joan, Wing Weaver, oh yeah. <laughs> I actually remember I used to have this card as a kid, because it was a common card and pretty easy to get. Yeah, uh, Wing Weaver used to be my boss monster. Um, let's see, well we got MST for Call of the Haunted. His life points are at 3,000, okay. Thessalos, hmm. Ah, that could help with the burn damage too. That's the most, yeah. So maybe that's the way to go. Um, what's in the graveyard? 28, 28, 27. Blue Eyes White Dragon. Okay, okay. So here's what I think we'll do. Uh, which has the most stars? They both have seven stars. Okay. Um, so let's, uh, Mystic Space Typhoon to get rid of, uh, Shinado. Okay. Sounds good. And then let's return just the one with the highest attack. Let's return Guardian Angel Joan. Uh, yeah. Okay. Okay. Then we tribute for Thessalos, I think. Yeah, this should work. There we go. Because Thessalos has the burn damage effect, right? Yeah. Ah, very good. Down to 23. Okay. Premature burial on. This card right here. Now I summon the Blue Eyes White Dragon. Yeah, exactly. Ah, it's got the classic artwork. Okay. And then we just, uh, yeah, attack with everything. All right. Sorry, Wing Weaver. Got to destroy you. My old boss monster. All right. So it seems like they left you a little wiggle room there. I mean, you got them down in the 2050 and then 2400 with Thessalos. But uh, yeah, pretty, pretty good one. All right, and number 80, let's see. Magician of Faith, wow, okay. Um, what are these? Steel Ogre Grotto, so 1800, 18, is it gonna be three Steel Ogre? It is, okay. So their life points are at 2900, okay. Hmm, huh, Lightning Vortex. Um, Magician of Faith, Fatal Abacus. What's in the graveyard? Swords Revealing Light, aha. Uh -huh. Okay, so. Now does this do damage per card? Each time per card. Okay, I think this one's pretty interesting. Um, hmm. Book of Taiyu. Book of Taiyu. Huh. I'm just thinking, can we use Magician of Fate twice? I don't think so. Um, but I think you do have to flip it face. Yeah, I think you definitely need Sukiyomi here. Uh, just to flip Magician of Fate face down. Okay, and then you can flip summon it, right? Yeah, okay, okay. Okay, take this, get back swords. I think this will do enough damage with the uh, Fatal Abacus. If we just flip everything face up, so swords. Okay. Yep. There's the three grottos. Okay, then let's try lightning vortex. Okay. And we'll discard Book of Taiyu. Boom boom boom. Nice. Okay, and yeah, with these two, yeah, that's fourteen hundred. Sweet. Okay. So yeah, that one was uh I don't know, they tried to throw a couple of tricks in there with like Book of Taiyu and Man Eater Bug. I guess, you know, hoping they prompt you to set Man Eater Bug with Taiyu, but no. You've got Swords in the Graveyard and Lightning Vortex. That's all you need. Okay, guys, and with that, that's uh, Time Duel 60 through 80 done. All right. Okay, so I think we'll just do some uh, regular stuff in the week now. Um, so yeah, let's just go to sleep. And uh, yeah, I did some duels by mail scheduled, so another week, another adventure. Alright, Cyrus. Get your game on. Yeah!
Uh, by the way, I did make a few changes to this deck. Um, I don't know if you guys will see them this episode or not, but uh, if you do, you know, I'll, I'll, I'll mention it. Okay, and I think we do see it this duel. Okay, Cyrus, don't you, don't you, don't you. Yeah. Couple face downs. Okay, so this is one uh, change I made to this deck. Let me just show you guys. Um, yeah, this card is in the deck now. First stream of destruction. So I'm pretty sure, <laughs> I'm pretty sure I said this earlier in the LP that I wouldn't use this card, but, uh, you know, we are going for like, you know, basically like an OTK strat, so I went ahead and put in three of this card. Yeah, pretty good. Um, ooh, two limited removal. Um, uh, let me do some math here. So that would be... 37 times 2, 74. Man, we get we can get close with mechanical chaser. Um, let's just go with let's just go with Drill Roy though. Is he gonna play a trap? Yeah. yeah. Okay, okay. So this wouldn't have worked anyway. Uh, it sucks that he used that on Drill Roy, but I guess that is good that torrential tributes out of the way. Whoops. What was what do you have face down, Patch Roy? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, not bad, Sai. Not bad. I guess with two limiter removal, we'll just we'll just go for some additional damage bonus in this one. I saw Dequichi attack mode. Yeah. Nice job, Cyrus. Nice job. Another face down. Oh no, that's it. Okay. All right. So let's see what we get here. Gigantus. Okay, guys. And just like that, the duel's over. All right, Sai. Now time to special summon a monster by banishing an earth monster. Well then, I can special summon Gigantus in attack mode. And now, Sai, I activate this magic card. Burst Dream of Destruction will destroy all your monsters. Yeah, and you see, like, even though we don't have blue eyes, that card, it, it's basically Raigeki in this game. All right, Mechanical Chaser. And now I activate Limiter Removal. This will double the attack of my Mechanical Chaser. You want to see me do that again? Limiter removal. Okay, guys. And with that, uh, it's basically game over. Go, Gigantis. Earth Crusher attack. And we won. Mechanical Chaser, go. <laughs> and it's that easy. Honestly, we got pretty lucky with this draw. <laughs> Oh my god, look at all that DP. Oh, that's, a, that's a fun way to start the recording session. Uh, 1430, yeah, so we get the times five bonus in that one. Mm-mm, good, all right. Ah, yeah, I lost. There's no way I can be fiery duelist. Yeah, buddy, I'm too fiery for you. All right, welcome, Flood. Take a look around. Oh, yeah, let's buy some cards here. Um, let's see. Trap special, spell special. Uh, let's buy one of each of these. I'm not sure what the percentages are at. Um, let's buy a trap special too. Um, yeah, I remember this being pretty good. Power destructions. Let's buy like four of that. And wait, fusions. This seems new. Okay. Um, now I'm guessing there's only fusion monsters in here. But let's buy. Eh, we'll take six. Now we'll take five. We'll take five. Okay, then we'll buy a few more of effect monsters, and that looks good for now. Uh, let's see what the percentages are on these two, and I may buy more. Is this okay? Yeah, sure. All right, so fusions, new pack, sweet. All right, and we're looking for some new effect monsters out of here. Um, Needle worm, pretty good. A uh, thunder dragon. Mm, that could help. Yeah, like, if I eventually get three Thunder Dragon, I will try showing off that, like, Exchange of the Spirit deck, because that will help. Uh, out of fusions, a uh, Steam Driveroid we may be able to use, honestly, because uh, we got some machines. Shane Joan, pretty cool, pretty cool. Uh, Chimera, Chimera, the Flying Dragon. Ah, yeah, Guy of the Dragon Champion, Aqua Dragon, nice, nice. Thousand Dragon, okay. Polymerization, that's to be expected. Okay, what do we get out of here? Gear free, good. Yeah, all these cards are good. Ryu Koki. Oh, another elite attack force. Oh, another mechanical chaser. That's good. Two more mechanical chaser. Great, great. I was hoping that was in this pack. I was hoping. Very good. That, that'll that definitely help out the deck we're using right now. Okay. 
and we're gonna see the percentages on these. Uh, Metamorphosis, wow. Okay. Anti-spell. Uh, Divine Rat's pretty good. Okay, so we, yeah, Thunder Dragon is new. That's our first one. Okay, sweet, sweet. So yeah, if I get two more of this, the Exchange of deck, uh, Spirit uh, deck is looking a little better. So that does help with, the uh, you know, getting cards in the graveyard and stuff. Um, let's see what else is new here. Right, like, a lot of stuff sh might be new out of here, the Fusion Pack. Okay, that's our first Steam Gyroid. That's good. Um, so this is at 60%. Okay. Yep, the two Mechanical Chasers. Nice. Uh, Zombira the Dark is new. Cool, cool. All right. And uh, out of here, we've completed 90%. Okay. 90% on Monster Reborn. 75%. Okay, so I'll probably buy some more Special Special 2 since we don't have... Uh, yeah, we're missing about 25%. Metamorphosis, though, uh, I wonder if that's legal. I'll check between episodes as far as that goes. And uh, Disappear is new. Okay, okay. So let's buy some more Spell Special 2. Yeah. And these are like 150, so I'll probably buy like... Uh, I think like 4. 4 is a good amount. Uh, but yeah, Thunder Dragon is in this pack. That's good to know. But it must be pretty, pretty rare because, uh, yeah, that's our first one we've pulled, so. Um, and I'm pretty sure we have all of this out of the Dark Hole pack. So, but yeah, let's buy... Let's buy four of these, yeah. Well, let's buy five. Let's buy five. Okay. Yeah, that's cool. All right. So let's see. Yeah, for Dark Hole pack, I'm not looking for anything particular. But I'm just making sure we have 100%, because I know we have 100% on the Harpies for the Duster, so. Okay, final countdown. Pretty cool. Yeah, we have three of that. Dark Magic Curtain. I think we only had one of that. Another Metamorphosis is good. Forceful Sentry. Wow. Hmm. Okay, yeah, so Dark Hole Pack is good. Um, Forceful Sentry. Wow. Yeah, I'm definitely going to have to check on that between episodes to see if that's legal. Reload. Yeah, Reload can be good. Yeah. I have nothing else for baiting out the magic jammer, but also to help fix your hand. Uh, yeah, and another metamorphosis is good. Tricky's magic four. Okay, okay, cool, cool. All right, I think that's good for now. Uh, no, I'm good, Dorothy. We'll save the other 2,500 for the weekend. All right. So yeah, uh, the getting two more mechanical chaser is definitely good for this deck. Um, in fact, it's so good. I'm gonna edit it right now. So, it usually does take me a while to edit the deck in this game, but, you know, uh, getting the uh, machines is what we're all about, so let's see if I can do this quickly. Mechanical Chaser. Oh, there it is, there it is. Okay. So I'll just add these two for now, and I'll take out some cards I want to take out, you know, in between episodes, so very good. Uh, let's save to that. Sweet. All right, let's do some more duels. Uh, Jade, you're up. Hey, glad you showed up. Yeah, get your game on. All right, here we go. All right, sweet. So yeah, that power destruction was definitely worth it to get uh, the other two mechanical chasers, so very good. All right, so what we got here? Magician of Faith, Exile Force. Uh, well, we, we got Raigeki, well, the equivalent of Raigeki. Uh, let's go ahead and upstart Goblin for one. Except cannon, okay. Um, this will look like we have limiter removals, so let's just throw out let's just throw out ground attack or bug draw. Call it a turn. I got a feeling he'll start with skyscraper. You know he usually does. So get your game on. It's my turn, so I draw. Uh, polymerization, okay. That's equally concerning. Cool, it's my favorite card. Elemental hero, flame wingman. Yeah, he did have Skyscraper. Okay, good decision. Go, Fusion Weapon. Man, this is gonna hurt. Sorry, Flood. My Fling Ming Man's gonna attack your Ground Attacker Bugroth. And now he's gonna use this super power, meaning you'll take damage equal to its attack. Good turn for Jaden. Very good turn. Uh, luckily, we do have... <laughs> well, we have Exiled Force and Raigeki, so... You know, it doesn't really matter which one we use. Um, but let's just use, uh, go, bear stream of destruction <laughs> to destroy his flying wingman. 
and I guess we'll follow it up with XF Cannon. Should I play United We Stand? Mm, ah, sure. He's only got one card in his hand, so I'm not too worried. Although Stack Steel does uh, change the equation. Go! Double Cannon! Barrel Blast! Alright, so it doesn't look like we'll get a quick victory on Jaden here, but that's okay. Yeah. He kind of went all in first turn, so yeah, face down card? Not a problem, Jay, not a problem. Let's just go with... Let's just attack first, in case it's Mirror Force. Uh, if it's nothing, then I'll set probably Magician of Faith. Okay, okay. Looks like we're all clear. Um, yeah, what else in the graveyard? Like, Upstart Goblin? Alright, and we have Burst Stream of Destruction too, so... Yeah, let's just set Magician of Faith. That's good. You're up, Jay. We're winning the duel. Card, Graceful Charity. That's a pretty good card. Pretty good card. Premature Burial on Spear Dragon. Okay. That is going to matter because, uh, yeah. Yeah. My Magician of Faith does have pretty low defense, so. Not bad, Jay. Not bad. He's got us down to 2900. But we'll take back a uh, Burst Stream of Destruction, so. Not too much to worry about. Okay. And he didn't stop our attack last turn, so... Um... Uh, yeah, I really don't want him to use, like, Torrential Tribute or anything here. Um... Yeah, he hasn't discarded it either. Although, I guess... Maybe I should risk it, because... Uh, let's play UFO Turtle. Because if it's not Trap Hole... Oh, okay, he didn't stop our attack last time. Yeah, now our uh, XF Cannon's boosted, so yeah. Take out Spear Dragon. No way, I'm sorry, Spear Dragon. Yeah, all right, and we win. Double Cannon, Barrel Blast. All right. Hey, nice move. Thanks, Jaden. Yeah, pretty good duel. Our points will be a little low in that one, though. Yeah, 322? Yeah, dope. <laughs> All right, Jaden. Yeah, until next time. Looks like Bastion's up. Look, I put my heart and two in these six decks. I'll use this deck to defeat Flood. Ah, uh, will you, Bastion? We'll see about that. And who's going first? Did, the, did, it, did he go first? I wasn't paying attention. Oh, he did. I've already done the mock, Mike. I win. Ah, uh, a couple face downs. Well, we got Giant Trunade. Shall I bait the Magic Jammer? Eh, sure. Let's see that Magic Jammer. Oh, he didn't have it. Okay. Well, then in that case, let's go with Gemini Elf. Yeah, I did throw some other beaters in here that we pulled, like uh, Gemini Elf and uh, I think I put Morse Raider in here. But now that we got, you know, two Mechanical Chaser, I think I'm okay, you know, taking either of these out or some of the other low-powered, uh, you know, beaters we put in here. Um, I guess I'll set the other Rising Energy. Well, no, he's going to put his two face downs back, so we'll just end with that. We'll just end with that. Because even if I do draw limiter removal, I'm not going to go all in. Because, uh, yeah, he should play his face downs back, um, yeah, this turn, so... Quantum Duel Theory, Premature Barrier. Yeah, not bad, not bad. Okay, so we'll get back beta, whoops. Okay, there we go. Now yeah, what, Bastion? Uh-huh, defending... Oh, he didn't play any spells or traps? Oh, okay, okay, I was about to say, I about to say, I know you said, oh my god, look at that minefield back there. Hmm. Boy, Heavy Storm would be pretty good right about now. No. Uh, you want an easy problem to solve, Flood? Go, Ring of Destruction, that's gonna hurt, yeah. Good one. So, yeah, that takes out Gemini Elf. Um... Dilemmas, dilemmas. Hmm. I think my best bet here is to... Hmm. You know what? He's probably got, like, Mirror Force or something. Let's see if I can get him to Mirror Force his own monster. Snatch, steal, go. Okay. 
All right, so we'll steal Beta. And now, Bastion, I'll attack with your own Magnet Warrior. So hopefully he plays Mirror Force here. Oh no, he didn't play anything. Penguin Soldier? Ooh, nice move, Bastion, because that's gonna return Beta to your hand. Ah, okay. Well, either way, that kind of works out for us because we know he doesn't have Magic Jimmer. I can take back Snatch, snatch Steel if I want to, and in fact, I think I will. Very good. Go ahead, Bastion, go ahead. All right. Penguin Savage. <laughs> oh, okay. Go ahead, bro. Yeah. Hmm. I can also take back Giant Trune. That is something I'm thinking about. Um. Hmm. Well, let's grab Giant Trune. Yeah. No, don't change. My turn. Ooh, another rising energy. Wow. Uh, let's see. Okay. Well, I think I'll play Blast Sphere. And what? Oh, right. I haven't summoned since. Dang it. I, sh I should have used Giant Trune first. Mm, I didn't think he had anything because he didn't play. He didn't play anything when we attacked with this beta. Hmm. Good move though. Good move, Bastion. I guess I'll end my turn. Hmm. All right. Yeah, Bastion might have us on the ropes here. Uh, we really just need to draw any monster. And we'll be back in it. Hmm. All right. Oi, will not ease up. Oh, yeah, that giant finger. <laughs> all right, Bastion, all right. Well, we might have one more turn here. Hmm. Oh, another face down, wow. That's scary when my life points are this low. Go just a theorem to be quiet. Hmm, giant rat. I am glad to see that. Uh, what's this? Call of the Haunted. That's not good. Oh, for, for his penguin soldier. Okay. Um... The real question is, do I think he has another trap hole, or do I just go in and attack? Uh, you know what? I'm not scared. Go, giant rat. All right. Oh. Torrential. Thank you, bro. Honestly, that was best case scenario. That's, that's kind of what I was hoping he'd do. Yeah, now he's just down to one card in his hand, and he cleared out all those monsters. Plus, he used Torrential after he wasted his Call of the Haunted. So, honestly, that was the best move for us. Another beta. Okay. Yeah, but basically, he wiped his own board for us. So, that was definitely the right move. Okay. The only thing I might regret is not taking back Snatch Steel instead of Giant Trunade. Uh, we'll see, though. We'll see. Drill Roy. Nice, nice. All right, Bastion, I summon Drillroid in attack mode. And with that, I think I'll end my turn. Let's see what you've got, Bastion. Uh -huh. Snatch Steel is basically game over at this point, though. That's a little scary. Go off of the Mocknet Warrior. Uh-huh. You gonna attack me, Bastion? Big mistake, buddy. Ah, according to your calculations, huh? Oh yeah, Bastion, did you calculate this? I've got a face down, go! Rising energy. So with this, I'll discard my other rising energy. And now I can boost Stroid by 1500 big ones. Counter attack, giant drill. Yeah. <laughs> now what, Bastion? Yeah, that's right, you end your turn. You end your turn, buddy. Another Drillroid. Good, good. All right, we're drawing monsters when we need to here. Oh, and it's playing the winning duel music. Sweet. <laughs> Even though I'm losing by like 2,000 points. Go! Jumbo Drill Attack. All right. No, no, no. We'll, we'll keep rising energy. Very good. 
I should reanalyze my formulas. Yeah, you should, Bastion. Alright, now I'll attack you with the other drill, Roy. Go, giant drill. Okay, and in case it gets, like, worse rate or something, we've got the second rising energy. Yeah, yeah, now what, Bastion? Alright. Wait for it, wait for it, wait for it. My choice has been... Ah, I called it, called it. Called that Vorse Raider there, Bastion. Yeah, attack me, go ahead. I just have to pick the right target. Ah, yeah. yeah, looks like I fooled you once, Bastion, and now I fooled you again. Ready for some deja vu? Go, Rising Energy. So I'll discard Giant Trunade to boost this Drillroid by 1,500 points. Counter attack, Giant Drill. <laughs> gotcha, Bastion. <laughs> Alright. Ooh, and we can do a little extra damage here. Alright, Bastion, now I'll tribute one draw right to summon Cyber Tech Alligator. Alright, get up. Metal Claw Attack. We win, Bastion. It's my deck floor. Game over. Alright, and we get 507. Yeah, we destroyed quite a few of those monsters in battle, so that's pretty good DP, honestly. Hey, I lost. I learned a lot in this talk. I have to recalculate my equations. Yeah. Oh, next Friday is the Dawn Switch exam. Ah, okay. The theme of the practical exam will be traps. Hmm, that sounds pretty good for the Exchange of Spirit deck. Ah, uh, maybe I'll try it, yeah. You're going to love this. You'll never be an expert duelist if you don't use traps to frustrate your opponent. Yeah, trap cards are pretty good. I mean, as this game has shown. Got it, young scholar? Let's see you stop your opponent's strategy using your trap cards. Ah, okay, so... Yep, it's exam time, guys. But it looks like... Oh, and we have 33-30 uh, on the DP. That's pretty funny. <laughs> Alright, guys. But I think that's gonna do it for, uh, yeah, this recording session. So, uh, yeah, pretty good re recording session overall, though. Got some time duels done. Got the uh, event with Cyrus and the event with Zane. So, and we got Zane unlocked. So, alrighty, guys. But uh, yeah, thanks for joining me in this one. And uh, yeah, pretty pretty fun, pretty fun recording session. And we got a couple of times uh, four bonuses as well with the machine deck. So that's good. All right, guys. But that's gonna be it for me. And I will see you all next time. All right. Have a good day.